Hello, magic casters of all shapes and sizes. My name is Chance. Welcome to my spellbook, and thank you so much for tuning into the 43rd episode of our first level spell series. Before we carry on too much further here, I would like to note that this channel is not intended to be used by those who are considered to be children in their respective countries. In the US, that's 13 years of age, but it differs based on location. So if you're considered a kid by law, Please click on another video or go to a different channel. I'm sorry. It's nothing It's not, nothing personal from my end. It's just the way YouTube wants it to be now, I guess. In any case, let's take a look at today's spell. Today we're going to be looking at Healing Word. Um, this is one of the best first level spells in the game and almost everyone with access to it picks it immediately. Uh, it is usable by the Bard, Cleric, and the Druid, and it is found in the Player's Handbook. Also, if you take Magic Initiate, I would highly recommend this. Uh, in any case, uh, let's take a look at the mechanics here and kind of break down how it works. The cast time is a very nice bonus action. The range is an impressive 60 feet. The duration is instantaneous, and the effect at a glance is as followed. Heal a living creature, 1 die 4, plus your spellcasting modifier. At higher levels, healing increases by 1 die 4 for each slot level above first. Your components are just verbal, meaning you just have to be able to speak. And your school is evocation, which is pretty cool. That being said, let's take a look at the full description so we know exactly what we're talking about. A creature of your choice that you can see within range regains hit points equal to 1 die 4 plus your spellcasting ability modifier. This spell has no effect on undead or constructants. At higher levels, when you cast a spell using a spell slot of 2nd level or higher, the healing increases by 1 die 4 for each slot level above 1st. Super cool stuff. I really like this one. The fact that it just uses a bonus action and has an incredible range, at least relative to other healing spells, it makes this so good, especially at first level. Man, I tell ya. It's such a strong choice for Magic Initiate as well, because um, but the, uh, the three classes, Bard, Cleric, and Druid, um, most characters either have an incredibly high charisma or an incredibly high wisdom. So that just works out so good for both of them. Um, in any case, uh, let's take a look at some alternative uses here. So one that I really like is the ability to essentially bring back a friendly party member into the fray. Uh, getting them above that zero hit points and getting them right back into combat. Super great. You could also use it on a creature should you be torturing them for information. And this is a great way to stop them from dying. And it's a great way to gain trust from individuals as well. Even those of uh, demonic or what would otherwise be enemies. It's a great way to kind of build that trust. In any case, uh, that's about all the ones I could think of. If you think of any cool ones or you have any questions or comments, concerns, or build ideas, uh, please bring it down to the comment section beneath. I really enjoy talking with you guys. That being said, I hope you all have a wonderful day, and as always, happy casting.